So this here is our pH test. We are going to fill up our compartmenter tube up to the 44 mark, and we are going to use the bottom line of the bubble there to uh, make sure that we've got it lined up. So we're going to keep adding a little bit more. And take a look at the bottom of the bubble is at the lines. So that's where we want to be. We're going to take five drops of reagent ROO4, the pH indicator solution. Add five drops, and we want to make sure that we keep the reagent tube straight up and down. Turning it slightly to the side will mess it up. And the reason why it messes it up is because it creates a larger, sur larger surface tension, so a larger drop is going in there instead of standard drops. So we're capping it, inverting it, and we're going to get a color match. Sometimes the best way to read this is to put it up against light or white surface to get a good reading. And so that is a pretty good 7-4 if you match the, the right water sample with that 7-4 in that column there. So now we would just simply pour this out, record our number, and go ahead and move on to the next sample.